Imagine pressing a button and instantly being able to communicate with any radio frequency in the world. This is the responsibility placed on airmen at the High Frequency Global Communication System Network Control Station, located at Grand Forks Air Force Base. There are definite times where I can get caught in the uh, moment to moment and kind of forget how important it is to all of our members of the military as well as our non-military members knowing that we are always there 24-7, 365, listening out for them if they ever need any assistance at all. We will always be there to protect and serve. Established in 2001, after the events of 9-11, the communication system supports global war plans and daily operations. The high frequency system remotely controls 13 high power global stations and supports 27 distinct missions 24-7 to ensure the U.S. always has nuclear command, control, and communication capability. One of the most important HFGCS functions is broadcasting emergency action messages during times of need, which are deeply encoded before broadcast to the customer. And EAM, emergency action message, is a message consisting of characters using the military phonetic alphabet. You know, Alpha, Bravo, Charlie. As far as the contents of that message, we are not privy to give out that information, uh, nor do we have that information. We send those messages over to the uh, right customer. They translate it and they get the message. In addition to emergency action messages, HFGCS provides phone patch support, automatic link establishment, reconnaissance advisory support, and launch support to U.S. Space Force, SpaceX, and Boeing. The HFGCS mission is proof that the 319th Reconnaissance Wing plays a vital role in the ever-evolving global climate and showcases our ability to support NATO and Allied command and control functions. Reporting from Grand Forks Air Force Base, I'm Airman Colin Perkins.